My name's Taylor and I'm an instructor here at Eco Training and I am sweating as you can see by all the shininess on my face. Well, I'm in Makuleki searching for scorpions. We turned over many rocks, we peeped into tree crevices with no luck, but then eventually we spotted a scorpion in the leaf litter, which I suppose is perfect hunting ground for the scorpion. Now, I suspect that we have a Parabuthus transvalicus, which is the most venomous species of scorpion that you can find in this area, but it seems to be quite a young one. Now, one of the things that's most noticeable to me is the really tiny little pincers, the pedipulps, these things. And in comparison to the tail, which is really, really thick and that's how we tell if a scorpion is venomous or not. Typically uh, scorpions that have got a really, really thick tail and these small sort of pincers or these pedipulps, they're using their venom to capture their prey, to stun it. Whereas some scorpions that have got much bigger pincers, uh, they're going to be maybe more actively searching for their prey or bigger ambush predators that are able to capture and hold down their prey. And don't really need to use the venom as much, so their tails will be much smaller in size. But rather don't pick one up if you do find one. So at the moment, we have got a UV light over the scorpion. And it's super interesting because it's sort of reflecting this lumo greenish blue color, which is quite fascinating. And it helps when it comes to finding scorpions because if you just use your normal torch, you're gonna miss them. Now scientists are a little bit baffled as to why the scorpions show the UV light and it has something to do with in their exoskeleton. There is a layer called the hyaline layer and that is, is what's reflecting uh, and showing, sorry, this, this UV light. There's so many creepy crawlies out there, so remember to leave a comment on what arthropod you'd like to see next. Thank you for watching the video. I hope that you enjoyed it. If you'd like to see more, remember to hit like and subscribe.